Hi guys, welcome to the live stream. Yes, welcome back to Candle Talk with Michael. Okay, guys, so I hope that you can see me and you can hear me perfectly. I'm gonna be waiting for you to give me a either a comment. Let me know if you can see me. You can hear me, guys. Welcome to the live stream. Today is October 9th, 2022. It's a beautiful day right here in Portland, Oregon. So I have one person. Yes. So let me see who's this. Is this Val? Okay, let's see who this is. Yes, one person. Welcome to the live stream, guys. Yes, so let me just put my glasses so I can see. Otherwise, I won't be able to read the comments. Okay, so I have one person here. I have three people looking, so I need to know who you are, guys, so I can say hello. Welcome to the live stream. Okay, yes, I have two likes. Okay, okay, I have three people. Welcome. It's a beautiful day right here in Portland, Oregon, guys. I have a lot of stuff to show you. Hi, Val. Mm, welcome, darling. Welcome. Yes. Okay, so let me just go into the other camera so I can show you what I have for you guys today. Let's see. So let me just go. Ta-da! Ta-da! Look at all these guys. So I'm getting ready to make 30 candles from a candle light. Let me just pull back a little bit. So you can see, okay. Hello, Sherry Griffin. That hi, welcome, welcome to the first time to newbie here. Welcome to my beautiful home, guys. So as you can see, guys, I'm getting ready to pour. Well, not ready to pour. I'm, I prep my uh, these thirty candles. Uh, the white one is gonna be for sultry gardenia, and the black one is gonna be for nocturnal bliss. Okay. So I already waked them yesterday. So they are ready to go. You can see I'm using the wick kit from 1617. And these vessels are the uh, West Coast uh, from 1617. Okay. You can also purchase them there. And um, before I forget, guys, 1617.com. Today only they have a sale on the beautiful containers. They have the texture vessel, guys. They have this is a small size and it comes with the top. It's beautiful. So it comes the small and the large size are 15% off when you purchase a case of 24. Okay, guys. So don't, um, I'm telling you, this is a great deal. So go and visit them, guys. So as you can see, I just finished making a candle. Oh my God. I love the city on this candle, guys. My secret formula, because as you know, I'm looking for my next luxury candle. So that's going to be the topic today. Okay. So let me just put this back. Okay, so let's see who's there. Let's see who's here. Oh, thank you, a and Creations. Hello. Gorgeous Concepts Salon. Welcome. Lisa Curtis. Welcome. Jamie. Earthglow. Earthglow is here, guys. And I just want to show you something. Let me just change the camera angle because I want to show you something very simple. This, I'm wearing this pendant from Earthglow and this beautiful ring. Let me see if you can see it. This is Moonstone. And this is a, 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 an amber pendant that I got from him. And uh, today I'm wearing this because I love this kind of jewelry, guys. It's so unique. Let me see if you can see the detail of the moonstone here. It's beautiful. Look at that. Yes. So today I'm not wearing any more jewelry, guys. You know, I usually like to wear a, a lot of rings in here also, but I just want all to. The focus of attention to be on this ring and this beautiful pendant. He does live streams and he sells uh, jewelry, he sells crystals, you know, and he sells candles, guys. I'm gonna link his website below, earthglow.com. Yes! Yes! I'm telling you guys, when he does a live stream, it's like it hypnotizes people because all the beautiful things he has online to offer. They are like one of a kind. They're beautiful. So go visit him. Go follow him too on, on Instagram. Okay. So Lisa Curtis is asking me, you know what, Lisa, let me just show you. So this is the, uh, the Evermore cylinder. This is my hidden passion candle. Look at how beautiful this is. This looks very high end. It has a, it's a double wick candle. Okay. This weights. Uh, 14 ounces, the net weight, okay? It's very heavy, it's very luxurious. Uh, at this price for $90, no, 85. These are $85 for the 14 ounce, okay? 
Oh, okay. Thank you, Earthgo. Thank you, Anne. Okay, so this is 95, but you know, guys, you have to, I'm gonna explain to you why it's $95, okay? So let me just show you the other one. This is my Evermore bowl. This one has 16 ounces, but look at the beautiful la uh, label. Okay. And this one is triple wick. Heavy, heavy, heavy. It, this screams luxury, okay? My other candle, Oceans of Love. This is my best seller, guys, and I'm running out. I think I only have 16 more. Oh my God. This is truly amazing, guys. So this also is 14 ounces, and this one is $85. The balls are 90, and this one is 85. Hi, Mia, welcome, darling. This is double wicked. And I'm telling you, it's luxury. It doesn't get any more bougie than this. And my, my, other, my last candle in here, this is uh, the Evermore Bowl, guys, also for sale on 1617. This is triple wick also. This is 16 ounces net weight. Truly, truly magical, amazing. <sighs> this sells for $90, okay? So, and you saw my other two candles, which I'm making right now because I ran out, sold out. Uh, it's a sultry gardenia and, what is it? Nocturnal bliss, okay? So check them out. Hi, Mia and Ali, welcome. Yeah, check them out. Okay, so let me just go to the other camera now. Okay, so guys, so I have in here prep all my candles in here. And I just want to tell you about this melter that I have in here. Let me see if I can just pull back and you can see. Okay, let me see if I can just change the angle so you can see better. Okay. So guys, this is the melter. I bought this from West Ham Candle Supply. Uh, for those of you that know Jeff Stanley, uh, Jeff Stanley, I consider him like a, a mentor of mine. That's how I was introduced really uh, to the candle business, you know, to the candle uh, universe. And uh, this is holds 19 pounds of wax, okay? So it's called the LCS 19 pounder wax melt, wax melter. Um, if you go to the website, it retails for $179. Uh, guess what? But it's sold out because it's so popular. So he told me it's, it's in order, it's in back order. So uh, check it out, check out the website, West Sound Candle Supply. And he also have new Christmas holiday uh, vessels that he got. He also offers uh, different kinds of waxes. So if you want, just all about Jeff Stanley, guys. Uh, he helps He helps us all, you know? When you go to his uh, DIY group on Facebook, which I'm gonna link below also, uh, he has really shown me the right way to do things, you know, and we all have to support each other. And I think, uh, go check him out his website, West Ham Candle Supply, and you're gonna love all the candle making supplies there. Also, he has a beautiful boutique. Beautiful boutique is called Clove and Ivy.com. And he sells barware, drinkware, main skincare, soaps, candles, uh, ladies skincare. He also sells candles, clothing, jewelry, decor for the home, and paper and novelty supplies. Okay, guys? So, uh, Check him out, clubeandivy.com. I'm gonna link everything below. Uh, you know, we are here to help each other. You know, we, uh, a small business, you know, it's, you know, why not? So yeah, so this, I love it to make, when I'm gonna be making this amount of candles, you have to have this, okay guys? Otherwise, you're gonna be spending, I cannot do this in the microwave because that will take me a whole day. This, just put the wax in here. It takes a little bit of time to, uh, to heat up because it's such, it's such a big uh, container. And I wish I could get a digiboil. Uh, as you can see, guys, I don't have the space to put a digiboil in here, you know. I like this because this is portable. I can take it once I'm not using it, I put it you know, on the table. So that's why I have this uh, I have this, uh, this, uh, this melter, okay? So yeah, I just, I just wanted to mention that to you guys. Yes. Any questions from you? Okay, so Lisa Curtis, uh, Ilsa Curtis, she said, uh, she has the everything, uh, she has everything, uh, 1617, all the vessels and everything. And she's asking about charging the corresponding price. 
Uh, you know what, guys? Uh, you have to charge your value. You have to far. Uh, you have to charge um, your cost. You know. Um, also, you know, don't listen to people. I've seen so many people ask, uh, asking questions about posting on the on their website. You know, on, on the on, on the different Facebook groups. Oh, how much should I charge for this? People are saying that I charge too much. He said, "Don't go by what people say, guys. Especially family, because family family could be the worst." critique you could ever have, okay? Some family members, unfortunately, this has been my experience, they don't want you to succeed because uh, some people, they like to sit back and just wait for things to come to them. They don't want to work, okay? We work, we want to uh, succeed, we want to help our family, you know? So don't listen to people, you know? Surround yourself with positive energy so for people that support you and that love your passion, you know? it's And you know in your heart, the value of what you have, okay? So don't listen to people. Don't let them people pull you down. When you go to the sales, don't tell them, don't get uh, people uh, telling you that you're supposed to uh, charge less. It's it because it's not that, okay? It's it's your business. Everybody should buy their own business and just, just, you know, just take care of your business, okay, guys? Yes. It's gorgeous concept salon. So she's asking which She's starting up right now, but I don't know whether it's a he or she. Uh, what week and wax should I start from 1617? I got the starter kit, but I want to order some more items. Okay, I have to be honest with you guys. You know, we're all different, you know? Like the wax and the wigs that I use may not be ones that you like to use. You know, to me, my favorite is number seven. From 1617, I use the CDN series, wig series from them. I like to to buy to use the vessels because to me they're like, I mean, it all depends on the market that you want to reach. I want to reach the luxury market. So is that the people that I want to reach? So I have to buy the best. And to me, the best is 1617. You know, so that's all I can share. Uh, so depending on the market that you want to reach, that's where you're going to order. But I recommend you order, you know, to me, the, uh, the fragrance oils that I love the most. It's from uh, Stone Candles, uh, 1617, and also from Candle Science, okay? Now, I just want to share with you something, guys, that I vow, beautiful vow, she recommended me a company to try. It's called Maryland Fragrance Company, I believe. Val, is that the name? I think so, yes? Yeah? So I ordered some fragrance oils from them, so they're coming soon, hopefully, you know? Uh, so I'm excited. So I'm gonna be doing a fragrance review with you on one of my live streams. So I'm gonna let you know how, what I think about them. Okay, so let's see. Yes, Cheryl, family likes to have free things, but they never order anything. Yeah, that's, you know, it's, unfortunately that's the way they, they are. They, that's what they want to do. Okay, so, Gorgeous concepts. He's, uh, it's a she's welcome. Okay, I have 20 people. Please more likes. I want to be, I want the video to go to do better on, on YouTube. Okay, so Jim V1, where do you get your weak stickers? The ones I have have no sticking well. I'm so glad you're saying that, guys. This is very tricky, guys. So I got these wig stickers from Amazon. These are the ones that have the yellow backing, okay? Now, it so happens that a lot of companies have this yellow backing. So I bought some of them that had like a little bit of a, like a tongue on the, on like a, something that you can hold on so you can pull it out. So I bought a huge amount of them and guess what? The glue doesn't stick. So I just threw them in the garbage. So I'm, these are the old ones, you know, that I got from Amazon. Unfortunately, I cannot tell you which one to use because all depends on the company. Yeah. So I'm using this, and when this finish, I'm gonna be trying other ones, you know. So we'll see. You know, it's just you have to test them, and the best way to test them, you know, how it is, guys, with this. Your testers. This is the best way you can test your uh, your wood stickers, your wig stickers, because you know what? It gets very hot, 
And if you see, when you pour the, the wax into the candle, if you see them sticking out, you know that they, they are not good, okay? So that's why I like to use this as to make sure that the, the, um, the wicks, the wick glue, uh, the backing is really sticking to the, the container. Yeah, candle science, uh, the wood stickers, the wick stickers, candle science. Okay, so I'm gonna order from candle science next time and I'll let you guys know, okay? Okay. Guys, let me just change the camera angle so I wanna show you something. So, for those of you that saw my video this week, I made a candle. I made a candle, okay? And I used two fragrance oils, which I'm gonna tell you. I used equal parts. Well, I don't have it here. Okay, equal parts. This one here. This one and a red current, also from Stone Candles, equal parts. Mm -hmm. I'm looking for the sample that I have. Okay, as you know, I like to put my samples on a glass thing like this. And I let it marinate for a few days. Okay. I'm not liking it now. At the beginning, I loved it. But now that this has been marinating for almost a week, the red current is way too overpowering. It kills the, uh, the old wood completely. And it so happens that I made a candle out of that, guys. And I don't like it at all. So that's to show you guys, sometimes you have to, well, you have to make the candle, of course, if you wanna see how, it's, how it smells. The CT in here is very strong, uh, the HT is not. Uh, so this is a kind of oil that it tends to, uh, it, it takes time, to, you have to cure for a couple of weeks. And also, I don't know if you can see, but in the, uh, let me just switch cameras so I can show you here. Can you see on the edges in here? It's it's kind of like a start to turn a brownish color. I don't know if you can see it. Right here in the edge. You see? It's starting to turn color. Now I don't know whether or not this has vanilling on it. I have to check. But that's the kind of uh you know, I'm not liking that. But I have to say, I don't like this at all. So I should have done, what I should have done guys, is I should have done a small candle. I should have done a small candle like this. This is wasted wax, this I'm gonna have to throw it away. So I'm just gonna remelt it and just reuse the vessel for something else. Okay. So, that's the result. Oh, Tiana is asking, I got these testers from Candle Science. These are the, uh, the mini. Uh, it starts with an with an I. Mini uh, mini infinity tins from Candle Science. Okay, they have different sizes. They have the mini and they have uh, the, the small and they have the large. I believe you know they have like different sizes. So go check it out, Candle Science. And what I like about it is that it has this kind of a uh, tiny legs in here. So when it sits on a surface, it doesn't really touch, you know, the surface completely. Okay. So this is a good thing that protects the, uh, the protected surface. Okay. Okay. And let me show you something else that I have guys. Let me change the camera. So I wanna change, I wanna share something for you guys. So I got, because I'm taking my own pictures now. So I don't know guys, if you heard from this company. This company here.
okay? Uh, the wicks, the wick should be put for the double wicking an inch to an inch and a half apart from each other. It should not be more than that, okay? Let me measure for you. When you double wick, ideally, because you don't want them to be too close to the glass, between an inch, you see, these are an inch apart, okay? That's what I recommend. So somebody's asking a gorgeous concept. Uh, she's asking what made me, what made me do uh, uh, stop doing hair and, and going to the candle business. Uh, you know, I went to beauty school when I late late after I retired at fifty four. So I we moved from New York. My husband and I moved from New York to to Portland in order for me to go to beauty school. I went to Paul Mitchell and I got my licenses. And I started doing hair. I worked for a salon and I hated it. I didn't want to work for somebody else, you know, and the salon, the salon environment for me, it was too much gossip, too much backstabbing, you know, and I, I only lasted for a year working there. Then I decided to open a, a salon in my home. So I never got into it, you know, I, I didn't feel comfortable having to kiss people's asses, you know, this, I'm, I'm just being honest. I just didn't feel like when you work on the service industry, you have to have that, uh, that virtue, you know, I just couldn't, when it comes to hair, you cannot make everybody happy, you know, and I just didn't want to have that stress, you know, I, I wanted to, be, to have something that I could love what I was doing, you know, and I fell in love with doing candles, you know, and to me, it's my passion and I just decided to throw the towel, you know. Uh, who knows if I'm going to do it in the future, which I doubt, but at least I, I have my licenses so I can do it if I wanted to. Okay, so let me just go back. This thing here, guys, is amazing for picture taking, you know. You can uh, put different backgrounds. Hi, Mr. Wonderful, welcome. He, he's asking, have you ever thought about double pouring to get the perfect smooth top? Smooth top? Well, I think, I think I get a perfect smooth top, you know? I think it doesn't get any more perfect than this. And I only pour once, you know? It's, it's pretty smooth for me, you know? Yeah. Okay, any more questions, guys? Okay, so yeah, so I just wanted to tell you, mention to, to you about this when you're taking pictures. Okay, guys, you have any more questions for me? Okay, let me show you different bags that I have for packaging. So, I have this beautiful bag in here, guys. I have it in different sizes. And I also have in this material. I think when you don't have the budget to have something printed, like I don't have the budget to get um, boxes printed yet, you know, so I look for different solutions. So this one in here. It's made of velvet. So put the candle inside. 
Let me see if I can find a vessel that I can show you. Okay. So this is the West Coast also series. So I just put the candle in there. And then I put it inside a box. Where's the box that I had? I have a box somewhere here. Okay. So I have this box and then I just put it in here. And I just close the box. So that gives so that adds to the experience when you when you're opening this. Okay, so Ray Perkins is asking, what do you think? What do you think about candles, uh, huge candles over five weeks? Uh, I'm not too crazy about them. First of all, there are, I will do them only if it were like, uh, if somebody requests them, you know, but first of all, you have to test them, you know, you have to, so you spend like every tester, it's going to cost you a lot of money because you have to buy first the huge uh, container. Then you have to, um, come up with the formula, you know, and then you have to test it and then you have to uh, see, and then you have to see who's going to uh, buy it. You know, because I'm not gonna go, I'm, I don't wanna go to the work of doing all that for just one candle, you know? So I may change my mind, you know, if somebody, if a lot of people come asking me for that, then I may, you know? I'm not saying, uh, the way I look at things, guys, I say, I never say never, you know? It's like what I said before, who knows? I may do hair one day, you know? Um, so we don't know. Yes, these bags, are reusable. Okay, so I have them in velvet and I also have them uh, on burlap. I don't know if you guys saw the Instagram video that 1617 did on, on Thursday. But if you go to uh, to Instagram, you can see the post, the posting that Vanessa did making video. Uh, so you can see exactly what she, she showed my packaging because I sent them the, the candles and she loved them, you know? And so this is the, the bag that I, that I show for that, that candle. So let me just show you. This one is more tight fitting. This one, this one is five by seven, but it's hard to put in because it's very tight. Okay. So if you can, if you like, okay. So then this, I kind of like this better because it fits better than the box. Uh, this box is not the one that I'm using. This one is um, a cheaper, a cheaper variety. And then you just put it in the box like this. But you see how, how nice it fits? It gives it like luxury feeling, you know? And then what I do is I take the, the label. Where's my labels now? I take the label and I just put it in front of the box. And that's what I use for packaging. So, you know, you have to think about things to do, you know? Now for the big candles, Oh, you're welcome, Ray. You're welcome. So now, for the big candles, I'm having... Hi, Mirna. Welcome, darling. Hope you're doing well. Now, for the big candles, guys, I'm having a problem because I don't have a box. I, I don't have the money to do a custom box for that. And the boxes that I can find online, they don't fit this, uh, this candle. So I have to buy what they call it, cheapers like this.
So I just get this, you know, and I just put these labels in there, you know, and and then I just mail them like this. So this is something affordable, nothing else I can do. So what I do for that is this. So I have this size bag in here. And I take the bowl. So here's the candle and then I'll just put it inside the box. You see? And then I put a peanut or something around it, you know, to so they come safe, so they are safe for shipping and then I ship them in this box. Yeah, these are from Uline. All my boxes are from Uline. Uh, the the Uline boxes that they have for 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 gift, uh, I check them out and the material is like very flimsy, you know. So let me show you the box that I use. If I can find it. So this, this is the box that I use. I ordered a hundred. It comes like this. Hold on, let me just go get it. So this is the cheapy box and this is the box that I use. Let me show you the difference. So this one has an insert. This is the insert. The ring is amazing, guys. Okay, so these inserts are just folded like this. And then this is the box itself. You see, it opens up by itself. Very easy. And then you just take the insert. Put it inside the box. What happened to the candle? What happened to the candle? Hello candle, where are you? Here it is. So then I take the candle. Let's make believe this is one of my candles, which I ran out, I'm, that's why I'm making more. So this, let's make believe this is my candle. And I just put it inside. Now this quality compared to the other one, this is the one from Uline. Look at the material. It's very flimsy compared to this one. This one is more solid, more thicker, you know? And the tongue in here, look at the front. This is the tongue from the this is the one from Uline. Look, I have. This is the one that you get from the company that I'm gonna tell you. And then you close. And 
and he has this tongue in here that you fold and you put inside okay now I want to be honest guys this is not a high end at all okay but this is something that I uh, I think we all of us when we're starting out you can afford you can just put the label on the front like I'm like I told you that I, like I do you know and then just put this inside another box and then just ship it so but this is the best solution for those of us that are on a budget you know that I'd rather spend the money on making the most beautiful candle that I can you know so and then later on as the company grows then I'll think about doing a more high-end uh, packaging okay but the experience of having opening this box and just getting this out of here guys this is luxury and that's what I wanted to share with you you know the experience because on luxury it's all about the experience you know it's like what Vanessa said on on the on on the Instagram live that she did last week this week uh, she said that you know we have to think about like we are buyers you know if I'm gonna buy a pair of Chanel glasses yes I want the case to be bougie you know to be expensive looking I'm paying for the experience of opening this beautiful candle and I think I'm giving you the best I can and I think that gives you you know it's I think it's good enough so gorgeous concept she's asking Paula I'm gonna put the links for the boxes down below okay so look for the information after um, the video finishes I'm gonna put all the links below okay let's see uh, okay last question from gorgeous which is your favorite wax soy or coconut blends my favorite wax is number seven from 1617.com so check it out in there hi Mary yes oh I'm, I'm glad that you like it yeah it's all about the experience you know when, when you buy a Louis Vuitton belt like I have you know uh, I just love uh, for example I love the unboxing that Earthglow did on his jewelry he had these beautiful small boxes you know with beautiful uh, he gives you an experience he at least for me you know he puts some uh, some other goodies you know inside you know so it's it's all about surprises and thank you notes no, no it's all it's all about that it's like making you feel good you know and also the product you have to have a good product you know like his candles and where are these candles now you know like his candles I always I keep them in here guys because I like to open them up I don't I don't burn them I love to have them open in here because it gives me like that's pie experience you know check them out yes this is from earth glow so yes 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 Ray it's all about the scent to me there's nothing more than opening and be a beautiful bottle of fragrance oil and just smelling it close you close your eyes and let it speak to you This is very manly. I love this wood wood. It's very masculine. So if you're into that, you're gonna love this. So you know that's scent is so special. It drives, it brings back memories. It could be good memories, it could be bad memories. Hopefully they're all good, you know, and it just draws you to buy. That's why when people when I tell people, when you buy candles, guys, when you make the candle, guys, the most important element on the label has to be the scent name the scent name is that's going to draw you in oh my god hidden passion those two words they make you uh curious so you want to see oh my god hidden passion i want to know what's in there so then you go and you look at the notes okay your name which is kind of romance in there so you're getting to know people hi my name is my kind of romance this is what i'm offering you hidden passion what was mail like? Blah blah blah. Then you make the sale, okay? So that's why I said to you guys, always make sure when you do your labels, some people do, do, do the labels and they put a lot of stuff in the background. You don't want to do that. You want to have clear information when you make the connection with the client. This, you draw, your eyes draw you into what? The name, Oceans of Love. Who doesn't want that? 
We all want oceans of love, don't we? Yeah, darling. And then you tell, okay, oh my God, what's in there? Again, you're saying hello to people. Candy Romance. Hi, my name is Candy Romance. What I'm offering you? Oceans of love. What do I smell like? Blah, 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 in there. And then it tells you, okay, uh, the kind of candle it is, so, so it will explain the amount, you know, and how poor in, uh, how poor in Portland, Oregon. Oh, my God. I wish we had smell of vision because you would love this. Oh, my God. Earth glow. Let me show you guys. Let me show you the vibe that Earth glow gives you. Look at these beautiful stones in there. Look at this beauty, guys. This brings peace. He offers this pack collection, relaxation. He brings you all the positive energy from the crystals, you know, and just close your eyes and just relax and you can just go, you know, it's it's amazing, you know? Again, this one is the other one, Serenity at Dusk. Again, beautiful. Look at these beautiful stones in there. I'm gonna put the link for everything. I'm gonna put the links for the bags, for the boxes, for this can for Earth Glow also. And don't forget, guys, to visit my website, CandyRomance.shop, okay? So do you have any more questions, guys, for me? So okay, so PS Hunters is saying I made number seven candle, 10% fragrance oil, two CD and number three on the four inch vessel. Wait four days, beats not knocking my socks. As strong as I want it. Any suggestions? Hit it. Okay, she hit it to 225, 30 seconds, and pour 201. Uh, which fragrance oils do you use? Which fragrance oil? Alan, you are a gem. You are a jewel. So, you know, so keep growing. Keep growing. You're going in the right direction. PS Home to tell me what which fragrance oil do you use? Because I always, always, always get the perfect if I you I mean if you, you have to use for me I get perfect uh HD when I use 1617's oils. Okay, I'm not experienced with a uh, food uh, sense because they are not my favorite, so I couldn't tell you, you know. P pumpkin caramel and pumpkin swirl. I I'm not into sweet scents, so I, you know I don't know. Guys, can you help her? Yeah, no, I'm you know it's it's like what I said to you guys. It's like what I said to you guys when I did this. I mixed two stone, stone candles fragrance oil. At the HC, it's not it's not there. The CT is here, but I'm not liking the combination. So, yeah. Try all the different oils. Hi, Mary. Thank you so much. Oh my God. Oh my God, guys. Okay, let's see what else I have to show you guys. Uh, you have to drink. You know what I love about Earth Glow also on, on his videos? I love the music. I love listening to the music. On, just You can just close your eyes, listen to your voice, and just listen to the music in the background. That That is everything. Yes. Hi, Ida from Sweden. Welcome. Yes. Again, let me just show you again. Let me see if I can just take it off. Hi, so bougie. Guys, look at this beauty. I love it so much. You know. Oh, you can you got epi epidemic sound? I do too. So guys, look at this beauty. 
Yes, everybody, everybody follow uh, Earth Glow. Yes. Okay, so you do uh, the jazz lounge. You got the ring. Beautiful. And I have the other pendant and the earrings that I bought, but they're upstairs, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go get them now. Okay. Okay, so Val, so you get a so you get a good HT. Ida, let us know what is your uh, your candidate name, your website. What is your website name? Guys, have you seen? Have any of you checked out my website? I need to get I need to get an. Uh, I'm hiring an SEO expert, an SEO expert, guys, because my website is getting no traffic, you know? I know I have to work on doing ads on Google and, and Facebook, but the money is tight right now, so I have to, you know. So I'm hiring a, an SEO expert to, that's what gives you um, traffic, you know, uh, that exposes you more, so yeah. Hi Magdiva, this neck piece is from Earthglow. He does, he sells jewelry. So follow him on Instagram and also uh, on his uh, YouTube channel. I am Princess, hi, welcome. Yes, let's see what I have for you guys. So I'm gonna give you the links. For this, this is, um, I paid a hundred for I think there are 50 bags on this, but I have different, I have different sizes, you know? I have five by seven, I have eight by six, and I also have, um, I think it's nine by nine also. So yeah. Yes. Yes, come on people, give me more likes. I have 31 people, please, more likes. Okay. Okay guys, so I think I'm gonna leave the, uh, the live stream here today. Uh, let's see. Any more questions? If not, I'm gonna end it, uh, I'm gonna end it in here, guys. Okay, let me, again, let me just show you this is one of the bags in here. Again, I love this because you can put any candle. So this is one of my candles and it fits perfectly. Actually this one is kind of tight. So I need to use a bigger size. So this one is too tight. So I need to use a bigger size. Let me see this one. No. What is the bigger size? It's the same as this, same as that. I just had it with me. So this one is the bigger size of them all. So this is what I do, I just put them in here, like this. Ta -da. And then I put this inside a box. So these are from Etsy, it's from uh, how do I get the custom made? Uh, when you order these these bags, uh, I think you can order them also on uh, on Uline, I believe so. But when I order this, these are used from Etsy. You give them your uh, you give them your logo, your art, and they do it for you. It take they take a long time to come. They, they took like a, a month to come, you know. So oceans of love, guys. Oceans of love is amazing. 
if you go to my website, guys, uh, I'll tell you all the story about this 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 candle. Um, I went to Greece back before a lot of you were born. I went to Greece to the Greek islands back in 1987, uh, century ago, and I remember being on Mykonos. I remember being on Mykonos and the Mykonos Island is one of, one of the Greek islands, guys, and uh, they have a lot of windmills, you know, and I just closed my eyes and I just breath, I was breathing the air, you know, and I just wanted to have that experience uh, on a candle, you know, so when I close my eyes and I think of this, this what, is, what this is giving me, it's giving me that, it's, it's taking me back to that place centuries ago. Smelling the air, the ozonic uh, vibes, you know, the different uh, scents, the sea saltiness, you know, and all that on the, in the air. And just looking down, and I saw this beautiful white town with uh, blue uh, window shutters, you know, uh, blue roofs. It, it was like magical. I just, I was just crying, you know, just looking at that time. I, I'll never forget because I, I, I get teared up right now. Just looking at that, at the beauty of looking at the beautiful town and that the smell takes me back there again, you know? So that's why I said to you guys, there's nothing more powerful than the, uh, the sense of scent, you know? Beautiful. I love this one. I only have 60 more left. And after that, I don't have any more of the vessel. So I think I'm going to have to do it in another vessel, but we'll see. I don't have an Etsy shop. I have a, shop, a Shopify shop. It's called candyromance.shop. Yeah, that's the name of my website. Thank you, Lisa. This one. This candle is very wicked, guys. This candle calls for love. Okay, the ingredients for these are the top notes, bergamot, lamet, and powder. Middle notes, amber, tobacco, and jasmine. Base note, sandalwood, patchouli, and dark musk. Yes. Oh my God, it makes you sing. You know what I mean? Yes. Okay, any questions, guys? Okay, so guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't done so, please share my content with all your friends and family. And please tell everyone about my, my candle shop. Do you have to get candle insurance? Uh, yes. You have to get candle insurance. I'm using my home insurance, which is Liberty Mutual. Uh, so it's all included on my house insurance. Hi, North. North Candle Call, welcome. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm gonna leave the live streaming here today, guys. I'm gonna work. Uh, when I'm, when I'm done here with you guys, I'm going to work and I'm going to link everything that I've shown you uh, down in the description box. So don't forget to look at those links, guys. And thank you so much for coming, guys. I love you. I'll see you next Sunday. Take care. Yes!